Let's settle this once and for all. Can plants feel pain? First, let's talk about pain. What is pain and how does it work? Humans and animals perceive pain through sensory nerve cells, the same type of cells that transport information from our senses, allowing us to smell, see, hear, taste, and touch. These cells form a network that carries messages from the skin, muscles, and organs to the spinal cord and brain. The brain then responds by sending back messages to the pain site that promote the healing process. It's important to remember that pain is also a subjective emotion, not just a physical sensation. Emotional pain involves the same regions of our brains as physical pain, meaning the two are closely linked. Neural systems like ours and other animals are one way to process information, but not the only way. Even though plants don't have nervous systems, they can respond to stimuli. For example, when an aphid attacks a leaf, this sends an electrical signal that goes from leaf to leaf to tell the plant to start protecting itself. But responding to damage does not mean the plant is in pain. Unlike us and other animals, plants don't have the specific type of receptors, called nociceptors, which are programmed to respond to pain. They also, of course, don't have brains, so they lack the machinery necessary to turn those stimuli into an actual experience. This is why plants don't care when we eat them. Who does care when we kill or hurt them? Pigs, cows, chickens, turkeys, fish, even lobsters, and likely just about all the other animals humans eat. Humans and many other animals, especially mammals and other vertebrates, or animals with a backbone, all developed similar central nervous system features. This means that not only is it certain that animals can feel pain, but that many farmed animals likely feel it in a similar way as we do. According to ethologist and Arthur Mark Beckoff, mammals all share the same nervous system, neurochemicals, perceptions, even emotions, all of which are part of the experience of pain. Birds too feel pain, as we mammals do. In a 2000 study, injured chickens chose food containing a painkiller when subjected to pain and allowed to choose their own diet. Maybe you're asking, what about fish? Well, actually, it's widely accepted that fish can feel pain. In her book, Do Fish Feel Pain? Biologist Victoria Braithwaite says, there is as much evidence that fish feel pain and suffer as there is for birds and mammals. Scientists know that animals on factory farms experience not just physical pain, but emotional suffering as well. Just like us, they are capable of experiencing boredom, loneliness, even depression. Okay, let's go back to plants. Even if you still, after all the science, believe plants can feel pain, remember we actually harm more plants by eating meat. That's because it takes up to 20 pounds of grain to produce just a pound of beef. So if you were to eat the grain directly, you'd spare more animals and plants. Hopefully this video will give you some peace of mind next time you rip off a head of broccoli, bite into an artichoke heart, or slice into a potato's eye. For more info on eating plants, head to chooseveg.com.